we just added a new product called durian flower honey and we updated the stock level uh, we set it the safe stock level is 10 the current uh, stock is 10 and the low stock level is 5 that means that like when they uh, after the customer have ordered and it reduced to 5 and below 5 uh, the store owner uh, will receive um, email notification from the system uh, saying that uh, the stock level is low and you need to add the stock things like that so after we we put this uh, new product uh, to be on sale you can see the durian flower honey is on sale now and is an added is a new product added to the store and when we look at the right hand side uh, that is uh, mobile apps uh, at the U store uh, front page any new product that added to the store will be uh, displayed on the front page as a feature product so this is durian uh, flower honey okay and we also have another coconut flower honey we have added as a new product but uh, look at this uh, the stock level is zero so let's go ahead and uh, add the new uh, stock and you have to be go to the discontinue product and then where you can actually update the stock level let's do this as 10 as well and the low stock level we change it to 5 and since this, we just add a new stock we can add it 10 so now we've added this stock this uh, coconut flower honey and we want to put them on sale and you will notice uh, this will be a, considered a new product added to the store it will be uh, displayed on the feature product as well okay so when we put it on sale okay let's refresh the our mobile apps and now you can see uh, the newly added coconut flower honey is uh, on the feature products and you go to the product page and you will see that you will actually appear here immediately after you put them on sale so this is how you uh, add the new product uh, on the product page and you also need to update the stock management module uh, showing how many uh, is available uh, to be on sale at the app store that you will display on the mobile apps uh, whatever product that's newly added to the store will be featured on the front page of your online store and uh, you see even though we use the uh, same photo because uh, as a demonstration so of course and if you have a, a different product you will have a different images okay so next we will move on to how to uh, process an, a new order when your customer uh, place an order uh, using a shopping cart and pay online and you will see the store updates okay stay tuned bye bye